How's it going everybody? Welcome back. Today I'm going to quickly show you guys the best VPNs for torrenting. So I've got Express, Nord and Surfshark, all of which support torrenting fully. Uh, so for example, with ExpressVPN, you don't really need to select any specific servers. All the servers support torrenting and peer-to-peer -peer activities, but you do have the necessary security features that you need to keep yourself safe, such as the kill switch and split tunneling. So for split tunneling, I typically like to use it this way. So if I don't want to use um, my VPN on my entire network, I would only use my VPN to uh well affect my torrenting client and that would be it so it's a pretty useful feature now with express vpn again you have over 3,000 servers in 94 countries and you'll be able to secure up to five devices for subscription now if you're looking for more servers and less countries is not really that much of an issue for you, you have over 5,400 servers in 60 countries with nordvpn and you'll be getting peer-to-peer -peer specialty servers and a whole bunch of bonus features and you'll be able to secure up to six devices per subscription. And of course, you do get the necessary security features. Definitely stick to Nordlinks for the fastest protocol. And you have the kill switch and the app kill switch and split tunneling and uh, just bonus features in general that can be very helpful. It's a very well-rounded VPN overall. Now, if you're looking for the best budget VPN that gets the job done at the cheapest possible cost, uh, you still get plenty of features. You have great performance with the WireGuard protocol, and you have over 3,200 servers in 65 countries, and you'll be able to secure an unlimited number of devices with just a single subscription, which is great. Surfshark is definitely one of the best budget VPNs you can get out there, uh, and you still get the features that you need, such as the ad blocker, the kill switch, a handful of protocols, bypasser, which is the same as uh, split tunneling. You have rotating IP in no borders mode if you're in a censorship heavy country. Rotating IP will automatically rotate your IP address while your VPN location stays the same, and no borders mode will help you if you're in a censorship heavy country. So there you have it. All these VPNs do fully support peer-to-peer -peer activities. Um, if you're looking for something that's very privacy and anonymity focused, go with ExpressVPN, especially if you're in a censorship heavy country, it will be the best option. And it's as much of a plug and play VPN as it can get. If you're looking for a VPN that is more well-rounded, focuses more on speed and performance and gives you a whole bunch of features, go with NordVPN. If you're looking for the best budget VPN, then Surfshark will be your best option, especially if you want to secure an unlimited number of devices with just one single subscription. You know, you'll be able to share your account with as many friends and family members as you would like. So that's pretty much it for this video. Again, you'll find links to pricing and discounts in the description down below, as well as full reviews if you'd like to learn more about these VPNs with regards to the privacy policy, speed streaming, and torrenting capabilities, as well as security and features. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.